The second Singapore Fighting Championship will be a special event with the first professional women's boxing bout in the country's history. Representing the Lion City, Shahida Rosli up against Malaysia's Ella Tang, and she's hoping the fight will provide a crucial stepping stone for local women in the sport. Doesn't matter whether I win or lose, but I want to show the Singaporeans that Singapore female can box. There is potential to grow. Um, talent wise, we have them, and if Singaporeans are willing to support us even more, we can actually train um, even better and, and achieve our dreams and go further. The fight game in Southeast Asia can be a hard graft with opportunities few and far between. But with the implementation of promotions like this one and the rising popularity of mixed martial arts, it's hoped that times are changing. If it was 10 years ago, right, people didn't understand what MMA or so was about. You know, they, they, they wouldn't want to put any money into it. Right now, um, people are starting to understand the sport. It was only four years ago that Ronda Rousey became the first female fighter signed to the UFC. It was a big milestone. But despite her success opening the door for women around the world, there are still few stages for up-and-coming fighters in Singapore, with MMA pro debutante Tiffany Cho grateful for the chance to show what she can do. It's really a good platform like for local fighters to explore. Like, I believe there are a lot of fighters who want to fight, but they don't have the opportunities to fight. It's not just the women who are set to break new ground at this competition. Mushafiq the Slasher Samad, who triumphed at SFC1, set to compete in a four-way duel for the WBF Light Heavyweight Championship. Uh, I'll be one of, I make history you know, as the first Singaporean to win this Asia-Pacific WBF title. Yeah, and definitely it's, it opened doors, you know, for more, more Singaporeans who wants to be who wants to be boxers, fighters, you know, anything in the fight sport. You know, yeah. A positive step for the fight game in Singapore then, with some of the best talents the country has to offer, raring to step into the ring and get it on. Andrew Whitelaw, Fox Sports, Singapore.